bet you weren't expecting that. I don't even know where these things come from. Where are you going? Right, let's just uh, shoot these things after they die. Are we... are we done? Alright, we're done. Random Varen Ambush. Yes. So, anyway, back to my... what was I saying? So if you kind of remember the, the bridge, or the skyway, it was a, a kind of a... a fairly thin piece of concrete held up by those cables. Like, this, that's not... That's not supposed to last 50,000 years, I know that much. At least not without a lot of maintenance. Like, maybe if you kind of maintain it, you can make it last a long time. But the, the, the Protheans have been gone for 50,000 years. Like, no one's here to maintain it. It shouldn't stay standing that long. And the fire is in the water. The water is on fire. Alright, let's go back up. Uh, can I not? Okay, I can get up here. Where am I going? I'm going... Wait, where am I going? Oh, there, okay. My bad. Going... nope, not here. Going... here... well, didn't we come this way? No, we, we came that way. Okay, we, we're going that way. Right, wow. And look at this, I mean, you see all the debris down here? Actually, I don't know where this debris actually came from, because everything's intact above us. But they, they make it look like this thing is kind of partially ruined. But then something like the Skyway is still standing. Like, you see the, the lack of logic? Like, you see how everything's kind of supposedly falling apart? Stupid machine! Access encrypted files! <laughs> no, I don't want to review protocol! I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with... STUPID MACHINE! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Uh, funny. Rogan Commander. So he's dead. All clear. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, research assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Uh, how do you know I'm Elizabeth? Your access card identifies you as Elizabeth Bainham. Is there something you require, Dr. Bainham? Not very good security, is it? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of subject species 37, the Thorian. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What does Zoo's Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Hmm. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That explains their strange behavior. Your pilot should be warned. 
Hmm. Joker, come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. We must find a way around the field. We must get back to Zoo's Hope. VI, what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. What do you know about the Geth? I have no specifics on the Geth as they relate to this facility. All sensors have been purposely decommissioned since their arrival. I want to know about Exogeny Corporation. Exogeny Corporation is at the forefront of human expansion in the new galactic economy, funding colonial development and securing resource rights to ensure our progress as a species. Further inquiries regarding company policy may be directed to consumer information services during regular business hours. Who's in charge here? Who organized the research? All decisions about local resource analysis and acquisition are made by on-site management deferring to the board of directors only when seasonal quotas are missed or exceeded. Individual employee records are confidential. Tell me about the Thorian. Species 37 was discovered several weeks ago when a small team was infected with spores while examining ruins near the Zoo's Hope outpost. The outpost was quarantined immediately, and study of the infection began. Within 21 days, 58% of colonists exhibited altered behavior. Within 28 days, 85%. Four weeks. That's not very long. What's the size of this thing? The Thorian appears to be a diffused creature. Its cognitive abilities are centered in large nerve bundles, but it receives data from kilometers of meandering tendrils. We have discovered bundles approximately one meter in diameter, but these seem insufficient to coordinate the massive sensory potential it possesses. It may simply process such stimulation slowly, or perhaps there is a nerve cluster of a greater magnitude we have not yet encountered. Is it intelligent? Can I reason with it? The Thorian does not exhibit the focused behavior of a predator. The release of spores is an act of survival, not aggression. It does trigger advanced behaviors in the humans it enslaves, but we have yet to discover whether it recognizes or is capable of recognizing humans as more than tools. It is sufficiently alien as to defy classification at this time. Do you know how the creature controls its slaves? The will subversion manifests as intense pain if directives are ignored. The effect is severe enough that subjects are soon conditioned against even minor thoughts of rebellion. Observation suggests the Thorian views its thralls in a utilitarian way. Care is apparently taken to avoid injuring them, much as a craftsman avoids damaging his tools. As long as no action is taken against the creature's objectives, the subjects are free to pantomime a normal existence until specifically tasked with something. So that explains the strange behavior, right, in Zeus Hope, and the guy screaming in the tunnels. <laughs> So every time they try to do something that the Thorian doesn't want, there's pain. Where's the center of this thing? The Thorian is present as a weave of tendrils across much of the lower surface of Pharos. Observation of enslaved subjects suggests there may be key clusters that are tended by thralls. Unfortunately, direct observation of species 37 is limited or non-existent. Right. Please access my personal files. Elizabeth Bainham, Research Assistant, Biomedical Division. Security Level 4 Exemption. You are currently under probation due to disagreements with management over established company policy. These sanctions may be lifted if your next evaluation is more agreeable. What triggered the probation? You were marked as combative about the operations of the Zoo's Hope Project, specifically regarding the handling of the infected colonists. As a result, you were tasked with monitoring the safety of the colonists for the duration of the observation. I don't know how that makes sense. Like, if Elizabeth disagrees with experimenting on the Zeus Hope colonists, why would you tell her to be in charge of the Zeus Hope colonists, right? She doesn't actually want to do that. Never mind. That's enough for now. Going to standby mode. Alright, so the next thing we're gonna do... So I'm gonna walk around a bit more down here and maybe shoot some aliens. And maybe shoot some 
guess. And they're dead. The Gath used these claws to anchor their ships to the sides of buildings. Indelicate, perhaps, but very efficient. How do we cut the power if it's coming from the ship? It will be difficult. We can check the other claws for weaknesses, but the Gath are very thorough. Right. So... Hmm. This structure seems to have significance for the Gath. Is it possible they set up this room to serve as a sacred temple of sorts? The Geth blur the line between organic and synthetic life. It's natural to assume they seek understanding from a higher power. I don't... I don't see how that's... You're just assuming things, guys. It's assuming things. How did, how'd you know? How would you know? Anyway, there should be... Nope, nothing's there. Okay, radar's jammed. There's enemies... is going on. I don't even know what's going on. Alright, so they're... F are you guys done or what? I think they're done. I don't remember... Upper level, upper level. There's like two staircases. I don't remember which one is supposed to be the right one. So there's this. One of them is loose. The other one is the actual place where we're supposed to go. Let me check this. This is... loot. Right. Uh, Predator L8. Turian armor. That's, that sounds like a good thing for... Oh, wait a minute. No, this is the this is the actual place we go. Kill these guys. Let me kill those guys, and then we're gonna go back downstairs. Up the other side. Oh, are they dead? Right, so they are all dead. Let me just go back down. So the other side, I think, is the, is the actual loot. Perimeter secured. Um, staircase. There's enemies here too, aren't there? Yeah, there are. Krogan. So the AI is programmed to avoid combat once you leave the room, it seems like. I mean, whenever I kind of back out of the room, they back away as well. I think we're done here. It's kind of an exploit. Oh, here we go. So that's the side quest. Good thing we came up here. Good thing we double checked. I mean, it's so easy to miss, like it's a dead end off a side corridor. If you don't, you know, check this side, you will have missed the side quest, just like that. That doesn't seem like good game design to me. I think there's actually more geth 
here somewhere. That's not a thing. These aren't things. Let's see. Terminal. Average decryption. Confidential. The test samples were due to arrive three days ago, but we haven't heard anything from the colony or the cargo vessel. We suspect the samples became volatile and recommend cutting off all further contact with the Nodacrux colony. Even if the colony is discovered, no one should be able to trace the events there back to us. Um, I guess that's a side quest now. Okay. Same as before, we don't have the ordinance to blow this claw. Let's keep looking. Slow camera pan towards guess. Dun dun dun.